Matt, what you been out to, man? You still Dude. dropping the sketches? I think yeah. you dropping sketches yeah. every day at one point. Yeah. I'm still doing sketches. I'm not doing them as much anymore because I feel like around like 2021, my views were getting really good and then they just kind of fizzled down. And I don't know if it's because sketches just aren't hitting as hard or if it's just the stuff I'm dropping isn't hitting. But I'm still doing that, and uh, I just started them, a podcast. Gotta get them know. titties in the algorithm, man. I do, man. <laughs> you do I do. You can't thumbnail. have too yeah. many dudes in, in your thumbnail. sketches. Yeah. You know what I mean? You, you can't, can't just have make many. a good sketch. Just make a mediocre one. Rotate the titties. <laughs> that's what I'm realizing I need to do. You know what I mean? Hey, that's yeah. a fact, though, because people was wondering. I started doing these reaction videos, like, last year, and they was doing well. I just I ain't been doing them as much. But as long as the titties and ass enough, oh, yeah. you go yeah. get some clicks. Oh, yeah, yeah, totally. And it, the but the thing yeah. that's, like, counterproductive about that is, like, you get the instant gratification, but in the long run, your brand becomes unsellable. Mm. It, you know? I agree. So it's like... You get, you know, your your homeboys be like, you seen that you said had in the video? But then after that, it's like <laughs> nobody want to buy that hoochie shit. But at the same time, though, I feel like it goes back to what you guys were saying. Everything's becoming independent now. So it's right. like you kind of are just selling to the masses now. It's directly you and the people, basically. I feel I feel like kind of like 2020 just poured gasoline on everything Yeah. to where everything kind of became independent. You know, but it is true. You kind of have to combine it with OnlyFans. You know, you kind of have to have like, <laughs> no, no, you know no, what I mean? No, like, no, it's get funny. on OnlyFans just as a talent scout. Be like, you got a lot of talent. Like, smoking a cigar. Be like, you got a knack for comedy. We know cats you know? do it. I, I, I don't know. I'll be trying to get <laughs> back into the catches and stuff. I mean, to the sketches and stuff. But I'll be feeling like people's attention span is so small these days. Like, Dude. you have to catch them. Yeah. So I mean, you got shit like TikTok now. You got Instagram. It's yeah. like you got to like you know do it so quickly and i'm more of a you know what i'm saying i know that you know we all you know we're all writers so i like to like flush it out like i'm totally. more on like tv show side of things in my least in my mind i'd be like man with this sketch shit, i can't even get Dude. it off like i really want to like a minute and a half sketch now is like the godfather people are like who the hell is wrong <laughs> like, the like people are gonna be watching like 30 second sketches in a theater and be like yeah it's just too long you know but people I mean, are sweating i'm like that with movies now bro when i'm watching yeah. a movie on netflix and amazon nigga, i'm gonna give you 20 to 30 minutes if you don't mm -hmm. catch my attention the 20 to 30 minutes i'm, I'm out, out bro there. i'm tapping oh. out yeah when did Mostly, we become yeah. like this as a society though we don't even give shit when, a chance. When, 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 we, when we when we lost faith in the people in charge of distributing content mm. yeah when music got watered down and movies got watered down and tv got watered what down. you mean by that lost faith in the people that distribute I mean, back in the day, like, you know, you would you you believe a little bit more in the box office, like on the weekend, like if right. something was going to be good. Like now we've seen so much sorry ass shit. Yeah. And we know that they are gonna yeah. keep making sorry shit. And at this point, we know that a lot of the people in charge just have no clue what they're doing. So they just green light and weird shit or the same shit. You know, they won't put any money behind anything new or anything innovative. They Bunch just reboots. Yeah. yeah. Stop rebooting shit. I hate trust, man. I trust, trust me. I hate a reboot, bro. Me too. He said, trust me. <laughs> trust me. I took the checks all the way through that <laughs> shit. I hate it. Oh, I hate this. Don't I hate this. this. <laughs> hey, I hate this shit. Let me tell you how many reboots My I've done. Is, I'm, not, uh, I'm not bullshit. I did a Harold and Kumar animated series. Uh, really? Uh -huh. Didn't get, however, that was the funniest table read I've ever been to. Uh, wait, a Harold and Kumar animated series? That's that just sounds hilarious. It was hilarious. Yeah. It was. And the network, they wanted to water it down. That's what I was about to get to. Mm -hmm. Not trusting people. The network wanted to water it down. The producers are like, have you seen Harold and Kumar? It's a rated R mm -hmm. movie. Like, this animated show is supposed to be TVMA. Right. But they wanted to water it down. This is what I heard. Now, I don't mm -hmm. know if this facts. Keep this in case this is a clip. Right, this right, is right, what right, I heard. Right, right. So I heard that was the issue. And so the producers are like, nah, I'm cool on, on this. All right. Harold and Kumar animated series. Mm -hmm. I did 21 Jump Street. You did MacGyver. Mm -hmm. MacGyver <laughs> and Rush Hour. Yeah. yeah. And, 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 wait, and didn't you write another movie too? Was it? I thought and it was, I just wrote Half Baked too. That's being made. <laughs> but that's a sequel. That's, that's a really sequel. A reboot. You yeah. know. But stop that shit too. Just yeah. make a new movie. True. Make a new fucking TV show. But you know what it is yeah. though. How it's, hard is you it, know what bro? I found out? The, the more I start to get in this shit, it really is predicated off of fear. And what I mean yeah. by fear is all these executives yeah. are afraid to fail. And yeah. so that's mm -hmm. why they go with other established things. They're like, oh, this this already works. They don't want to take any chances on any new shit. And but, that's why it happens. But also, yeah. all of these executives, not all, but a majority, a lot of them, mm -hmm. they um, are not the tastemakers that right. they have been given the credit for being. Facts. So you've taken the yeah. credit for decades Facts. and decades yeah. of other shit when you don't even know why that the show that you're attached to even worked right. to begin with. Mm -hmm. So yeah. now you're Mr. Honcho. 
So what do you do? You never had the taste. So you look at the stats. Yeah. And people are losing <laughs> yeah. faith, not yeah. just in the system, because like celebrity used to be like this thing to where there was like the curtain, like the whole Prince effect oh. and rock star effect. It's over. P it's done because everything's like reality now. That's why I think sketches aren't hitting as hard because people kind of want to know more just who you are. And see, you know but, that, I mean? but that could be and problematic. They want to know you. That could so, be problematic too, though, because I feel like there should be that buffer between, you know, entertainers and yeah. people. And sometimes, like, and I found myself just sharing a little bit too much. And I'd be like, man, like, I don't even have no fucking privacy. I was going to ask you about, yeah. see, Tony Baker had told me that he was like, you need to share more of yourself, which I don't think he was wrong. I mean, I feel like I, I probably was pr just promote, promote, promote. But at the same time, I'm like, what is sharing too much? Like, right. I feel like, don't we got to have yeah. some sort of privacy? No, keep that fucking privacy and don't share anything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Certain, just certain put, put whatever too. you want on the stage, but outside of that, keep that anonymity or at yeah. least that mysteriousness. That's exactly what I was about to get to. It's like, bro, like, how about you do something that's worth some shit? Keep some mystique about yourself, then just keep doing whatever the fuck you're doing that you get yeah. accolades for. Like, back in the day, again, like, you know, come from an older generation of motherfuckers that was doing shit, like, you had to be like one of the best people at what you did to become famous. Back. So yeah, people true. were just worried about being the best at what they did, whether it was a singer, mm -hmm. a dancer, an artist, mm -hmm. whatever, architect, don't matter. Now people are just worried about the fame aspect and the clout and the, this, that, and the other, instead of just like, you know, honing the talent. Right. But everybody's got a camera now too. And so everybody it's like wants to be where everything. the celebrity used to be, the cameras were fixated on one thing. Now it's like flipped. So oh, yeah. everybody kind of wants to be in front of the camera now. Like your your aunt and your uncle are like making videos. That's now, so true. My mama, so my mama hit me up one day. She was like, "My mom was crazy. like, I'm gonna get on TikTok. Like, you gonna get on TikTok <laughs> because, because as far as far as she's yeah. concerned or whatever, like you, there's so many people who you're like, well, if that person made it through or whatever, because a lot of people figure it out just by being consistent. Mm -hmm. That's like, yeah. right. Uh, mo right. Most of these sketches are trash. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like when, when someone comes through and it's actually some funny is happening, it's real refreshing. Everybody fucks with it. Everybody's reposting it. It goes super viral because most of that shit is lukewarm at best. Yes. That's a fact. It's meh. It's a lot of meh. Yeah, it is. So I much, love so writing much. sketch. Like right. I, I like like the old school like SNL, right. like you know beginning, middle, end where there's like a twist at the right, end. You know, right. like that's what I always loved. But it's sometimes hard to get people to pay yeah, attention that's too to long. Them. You you want some too YouTube long. shit? Yeah, you got to you know? get them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. that's YouTube. You that ain't, set yeah. them up. But yes. not even YouTube really. You know, well, well I mean, you, YouTube, they won't even pay you if your videos are not a certain length. I don't right. know you reach mm -hmm. different brackets. So, like, YouTube is like the, the medium short form, but I you, feel like, platform. You can yeah. monetize your YouTube shorts now, though. Yeah, you like heard. YouTube yeah. pays the most. Yeah. Out of mm -hmm. any no, 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 Facebook. no. Facebook. Really? Facebook, I heard. Facebook right, right. is paying. More. No, no, no. Well, they pay more than YouTube. But it take, it take more to get. Um, associated with facebook or whatever right, right to qualify but right. don't people yeah, get demonetized yeah, all the time to on say because you youtube yes. you're just monetized off rip like yeah oh just what, yeah wait well, yeah, okay yeah you that's have what i'm saying more yeah that's what i'm saying facebook yeah. is some special shit like right. how they got a uh, red table talking all that shit youtube red or whatever right. what, what, that, <laughs> what that shit was on what the, <laughs> what the red table talk was on bro facebook <laughs> facebook <laughs> elite, red. Nigga. Yeah. Yeah. damn yeah. nighttime facebook after dark but it's crazy too because like my my like my nephew he basically is just all he watches is YouTube so he has no concept of TV like kids now it's crazy it's literally I'm, just I'm YouTube the same way like, crazy, I, I mean I watch you know? YouTube and then I'll watch Netflix if something right is is, is yeah. hitting but like I just my, I have YouTube on my TV YouTube on my phone and straight up mm -hmm. when I, I go just, to my little cousin's house or little homie's house bro they do they watch YouTube and that's why like all these podcasts and random youtube series you'd be like who the fuck is watching these and you'd be know, like these bro. fucking these kids yeah. From. yeah where are these millions of views yeah. who are you right. it's like nah, it's, it's, yeah. but they're there hey man it, it is all about consistency bro i was just telling my home that's why i tell comedians that's not booking stuff to just get online and be consistent because mm. at least you're building a fan base because if you just waiting for somebody to choose you mm -hmm. you may be waiting for a while <laughs> down i get it hate that i keep winning stab my back is telling